Hey everyone. So, um, oh guys, okay. <sighs> I'm trying to figure out where do I want to start. I know I've been kind of missing for the past uh, almost week here. Um, I had some stuff go on at home um, with my hubby and he got sick and went into the hospital for a couple days. He's doing a lot better now. Um, kind of just come back to that, okay? <laughs> I wasn't going to do a vlog. Um, it's it's late at night, honestly. Um, everybody in the house is asleep. I'm the only one up. But I was not going to do a vlog. It's just that I got to binge watching everyone's vlog, uh, Ricky's, um, HCG Road. Um, I haven't started Sweat VTs yet. But before I started hers, it was just like, I was watching vlogs and I'm like, wait a minute, what is going on? What did, what did I miss? Like, did I miss something? Did I miss where, I mean, what did I miss? Because I feel like I've, I'm, I'm kind of out of the loop here. <laughs> so I haven't been vlogging and I haven't been able to watch vlogs the past few days. Um, but what's going on? Why, uh, I know Ricky was saying her vlog um, Monday morning, today is kind of like Monday night. But she was just saying that, you know, everybody's not going to do Dr. Simeon's protocol and be, you know, true to Dr. S's pop and that's okay. They have to do what works for them. And, you know, if you don't want to, uh, uh, like watch her journey because she's, she's doing what's working for her, then you can unsubscribe. And I'm like, okay, you know, I mean, I know I wasn't talking to me cause I, I'm definitely not that type of person. I honestly don't follow Dr. Simeon strict, strictly to the T either, so I'm not going to lie and say that. Um, and then I watched HCG Bro vlog, um, kind of binge watched her vlogs, and she was just saying, you know, in her Dear Subscribers video, um, she's not perfect or anything like that, and if you don't want to be subscribed to her, unsubscribe. I'm like, wait, 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 what did I miss? Did I miss something? Did I miss where, I mean, I don't understand. Anyhow, I guess I'm just not getting where someone's not being supportive because everybody's not strictly pop. Who are you to judge? I don't get it. I'm sorry. I just, I've always been that way since just the beginning of the protocol. Like, who are you to judge the way that someone else does something if it's working for them? Um, as long as they're not saying, yeah, I'm out here eating a cheeseburger and fries and having 500 calories and you can do it too because that works for me. I mean, as long as they're not saying that, I don't really see an issue with it. I mean, see, people do, it's so many different protocols out here, and you have to do what works for you, and if you want to do the 800, do the 800, if you want to exercise, exercise, I don't, I don't see the problem, and I agree, we're all just, I'm here for support, I'm here to get support, and I'm here to support other people, that's why I'm here, I'm not here to judge anybody, I'm not here to criticize anyone, let me just put that out there now, I'm not that type of person, um, I wasn't even going to do a vlog tonight, I really wasn't, um, but I just got, I'm like, wait, you know, I just got to watching the vlogs. I got a little, little intrigued, a little upset, like all at the same time. <laughs> like, I thought that's what we were here for. I thought we was here to support each other and watch each other's journeys and just kind of see, oh, you know, if we need help because we all stumble, don't we? Like, don't we all stumble? Don't we all need help? Don't we all slip? Don't we all fall and need help getting back up? I mean, don't we all need some type of encouragement, some type of support? I know I do. I know I do. Anyhow, just wanted to say that real quick and get that off my chest. I don't know. If, I have a ton of subscribers. If somebody want, doesn't want to watch me because I eat broccoli, oh well. <laughs> that's your problem, really. That's not my problem. You can very, very, very much so unsubscribe. I don't give two flying fucks. Not really. I don't. Um, but yeah, I don't care. So, anywho, moving on, I digress. I haven't been on here because my hubby had got sick Wednesday night and he went to the hospital and he was there for a couple days. Um, he's fine now. He's, everything, he's, he's, a lot, he's doing a lot better. Um, we were both on protocol, you know, both doing the protocol. Um, while he was in there, I tried really hard to just kind of maintain um, and stick to protocol. I want to say I slipped a whole, whole lot. Honestly, I it was it was kind of weird for me because it was like I really wasn't hungry, and then when I did get hungry, it was like nine ten o'clock at night, 
and I just kind of, I just grabbed what whatever was there. I tried to grab the most healthiest thing, um, but it wasn't always the best option. But I didn't really just like completely go off off into the the deep end and just fall down the black cheek hole or whatever. I didn't do that. I just just was really concerned about my husband and his well-being. And while he was in the hospital, of course, he wasn't on protocol. What the hell? Who, who, who cares? What? He's not going to eat. <laughs> He's not going to eat protocol food in the hospital. It's just, so I wasn't, I wouldn't expect him to. Um, but the craziest thing was he, I don't want to go into details of what happened because I just, I don't want, I don't like reliving it. Um, but he's, like I said, he's doing a lot better. Crazy thing is, he was in the hospital, he was in the hospital food, um, he even had Subway, um, he got out the hospital and he was down seven pounds. <laughs> what? <laughs> down seven fucking pounds. Seven pounds in like two days. I was like, what, 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 what happened? <laughs> so, I don't know, I, I thought that was kind of, kind of funny, um. It was down seven pounds. I was like, here it is. I'm freaking out. I'm stressed out. I'm freak, you know, I'm having a hard time just not trying to eat off protocol and all of that. Tom was in the building, so I had like all these things working against me. And you dropped seven freaking pounds, and here it is. I can't even drop one. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Very interesting. So that's kind of where I've been. Um just I, I dealt with that and then like I say he's all better now he's home he's actually back to work he went back to work yesterday so we're doing good he's doing good um, he's, he's having a hard time getting back into the groove of the protocol so I'm hoping he can get back into things I know that him being sick and being in the hospital a couple days threw him off um, threw me off a little bit too not not probably as much as he did but it, it did throw me off a little bit but I'm just Tom's gone and I feel like with Tom being gone I can get back into the groove of things so I haven't weighed since last week um, Tuesday when I, I did my vlog honestly um, did I weigh Wednesday I'm trying to think I know I weighed Tuesday and I think I was down 2.2 I think that next day I was down one point I don't know I don't know guys I'm sorry I don't want to lie to you I, I don't even have my notebook where I was keeping track of anything so I don't know for sure um, I just know last time I weighed I was I was down total total about 13 I want to say about 13 pounds either 12.8 or 13 somewhere around there for me um, that's where I was so pretty happy with it things were going really smooth uh, like Tom just left and I'm getting back into my groove of being on protocol and get back into my routine my daily routine of um, my eating only problem I'm having guys honestly is that I am not hungry I literally I, I eat an orange in the morning um, and I might have some oyster crackers at work maybe but I have like, I eat an orange and I drink two liters of water and I'm really not hungry until about eight o'clock. And then I'll eat dinner, which uh, today was fish and broccoli. And today was steak and broccoli. Um, well, actually steak strips and broccoli. <laughs> but that's it. I've really just been, really have not been eating, but it's not necessarily meaning that I'm dropping tons of weight because I'm not. Um, Tom really helped me up for a few days there. I really didn't get on the scale too much. Um, but I was just hoping, I was keeping, I was trusting the process and hoping that I was losing inches. So that's what, that's just kind of what I've been doing. Um, and tomorrow I'll get on a scale and I'll actually weigh and I'll be my first time weighing in like a week. So I just really wanted to come on and, and, and give an update here. So let you all, let everyone know what's going on and just kind of talk about that. Um, you know, the, the the vlogs that I was seeing and as far as people not su being supportive because you're not pop or whatever, you don't want to support me because I'm not pop, then please don't. Keep your, I, I, that, that's the case, I don't need that type of support, okay? Um, I absolutely love everybody who's vlogging. I enjoy watching your vlogs. 
um, Erica Grant. I, I love her. I know she's she's kind of new on the scene, so but she's she's pretty. I like her. I like her. She's real. I can understand her frustration. I can understand her struggles. Uh, ACG Rowe. What can I say? I love her to pieces too. I just binge watched like she had did like four. I missed like four or five of her blogs. Vlogs. I just binge watched all of them. Ricky. I absolutely love Ricky as well. Ricky reminds me of me so much. <laughs> She reminds me of me so much, um, and I know she probably doesn't even know this, but she reminds me of me so much, like even though we, we don't talk on a daily basis or anything, but I just watch her vlogs and I'm like, oh my God, I totally see me there. I totally, when I was in the 180s, I would get down to 182.2 or 182.8 and then I cheat and get up to 185, then I get back down and I get, and so I just, I, I really relate to her journey and everything she's going through, so. And Sweet Fig Tea, she's just like a vibrant, positive, like when I watch her, I feel her enthusiasm through the screen. So I, I enjoy watching everyone's vlog. I even enjoy Heather and Debbie. Um, and I, I like Heather. I, I like Heather. I, she's pretty new to me. Um, but she's following protocol. She's the one following her protocol. She's sticking to it. And she's like, hey, you know, going to go. She's just really focused and I can tell she's really focused because she's not letting nothing break her concentration. <laughs> she's the girl. She's like, um, well, this is what I ate. I, she, I, she was on a bike ride one day, and I'm like, I know that's right, girl. She was even sweating. I'm like, all right, you know. So I watch everyone's vlogs. I don't always comment, but I do watch them. Um, even Debbie. Debbie's a strictly pop girl. She does not do my, but that's fine. But she exercises, and I love that. You know, I'm like. Please continue to, she's like, I'm going to continue exercising anyway. Go ahead. Why not? I agree with you. We all need to do some, some form of exercise. You can't say, uh, you know, not move your body forever. Um, and I have a, well, I think she said a sedentary, which is pretty much like a job where you sit down all day. I have a sit down job all day. So whenever I can go to the gym and hop on a treadmill, I do go to the gym, hop on a treadmill, 15, 20 minutes. I think it's nothing wrong with that. And I don't think it's nothing wrong with being pop. Nothing at all. Follow it. If that's what you choose to do, it's working for you. Awesome. Um, but yeah, I, don't, I, I won't criticize anybody for being pop. I won't criticize anybody for being mop. I won't criticize anybody for trying something new or different. As, as long as you know the precautions, if you know what the possible consequences are, hey, go ahead, you know. But, um... I think that we all have our, a different journey and we're all here to kind of share share our journeys with each other and support each other. So I guess that's it, guys. This video is long. I really didn't mean for it to be this long, but I will see you all um, in the morning. I'm about to continue watching vlogs because I'm not sleepy. Um, well, another thing I will say, not only am I not hungry, but I'm like extremely energetic, like like wired. Like I feel like I'm wired right now. If I don't, y'all might get that. <laughs> Y'all might get like, she's wired. I'm wired. So, <laughs> promise. All I had was HCG and water and nothing else <laughs> besides the little foods I've been eating. That's it. So, I'm just, I feel really good. So, anyway, I'll talk to you all later. Bye. Peace, love, and hair grease. Smooches. <laughs>